Congratulations on your Sitgo wheelchair purchase. Let's take a look at the assembly process. So, what's in the box? Upon removing all contents from the original packaging, you should have two wheels with support bars, the wheelchair body, two foot supports, and an Allen wrench. To start the assembly, make sure you can tell which part of the wheelchair is the correct side up. To determine this, take a look at the main wheelchair frame. In the correct position, the sidebars will be positioned noticeably higher. If needed, mark the top side with a piece of tape to help you out. Next, turn the wheelchair frame right side down. For shipping purposes, the sidebar may have been loosened for easier packing. Make sure the sidebar is one and a half inches from the metal rectangular block. Use the provided Allen wrench to lightly tighten the screw on top of the rectangular block once the desired position has been reached. This is also how you will adjust the sidebars later on as you start the fitting process. Next, remove the black end caps from the wheel blades. With the wheelchair frame still in the right side down position, insert one of the wheel blades into the slot provided in the rectangular metal block. Use the scored lines on the wheel blade as guides. The scored lines should be facing outward. In addition to the scored lines, there are also divots in the metal, meant to hold the screw in place when you tighten the leg bars. Tighten the thumb screw to lock in the wheel blade's position. This is just the starting height, and later on you will learn how to adjust this through the fitting guide. Repeat this process for the other wheel, then put the end caps back on. The fully assembled wheelchair should look like this.